So we're here at Great Bear Wilderness. We're going to take a look at two of our ambassador animals, Arky and Aussie. Both of them are polar bears, male and female residents of Great Bear Wilderness. Now if we take a look at their new home, it's quite a bit different than the old home that they came from. We have naturalistic substrate, big word that's really just describing the dirt as well as the shrubs in the environment. What this does is it gives Arky and Aussie a chance to play with things in their environment much the same way that their wild counterparts do. For example, you're going to see Arky and Aussie are trying to create a new species of brown bear. They're rolling around in the dirt. This provides a lot of psychological enrichment for them. Now their new home is about 9,000 square feet and one of the really cool things about it is their body of water. Each one of the bear habitats has a huge body of water. Each one of these body of waters hovers around 78,000 gallons. This particular one is 78,000 gallons of water and has a beautiful waterfall to help keep the water circulating. Now the cool thing about this is that it gives us a chance to practice what we preach. We're working with Polar Bears International to help create awareness as to how global climate change is affecting the polar bear. And even more importantly, how simple energy conservation tips help people as well as polar bears in their natural environment. For example, all of the water here at Great Bear Wilderness is constantly recycled through a filtration system. All together, the water system comprises about 300,000 gallons of water. And by recycling this water, we save about 10 million gallons of water per year. So definitely gives us a way to practice energy conservation here. So by coming here to Great Bear Wilderness, you can see Arky and Aussie in their new habitat, frolicking the way their natural counterparts would do out in Alaska, also gives you a chance to see how we're practicing energy conservation but more importantly, gives you the opportunity to go nose to nose with a polar bear. So let's go take a look at some of the other animals and their habitats here as well.